hello guys welcome to my youtube channel today is another video where i'm going to be teaching you how to max images into shapes in pixel app and today we are going to be going for another pattern which is the automatic pattern which makes everything perfect and beautiful so please do well to like do it to subscribe to this channel if it's your first time of being here you're very very welcome we appreciate you we love you and if you're a returning subscriber thank you for being here and supporting us so today we're going to be talking about max skin images i'm going to show you how to max images and without wasting much of our time let's get right into the video all right guys so here is another way to um max images in pixel lab so We've seen the first pattern and this pattern is a more perfect and easier pattern to use when creating designs because it, it does the job very very well. So without wasting much time, I'm going to show you how to max an image in your design. So first things first, let's change our background to, so we'll go to the background interface which is the fourth icon. Let's change it to a simple white background. Okay, now we want to mask our picture into this circle shape. So we want to mask the picture into the circle shape. What it means is that the picture would be inside the circle shape. So how do we do it? Let's first off bring our picture. So you go to your phone. So you click on import. Go to your interface click on import go to your phone you bring the picture you want to max so let me see i'm using this picture so this is the picture we want to max for today so what you do is you will place the picture how you want it to be so let me say i want the picture to be like this so i'll place the picture like this first so after you've placed the picture like this on top of the shape then you would change the background from this white color sorry you would change the background from this white color to to a transparent background so i'm going to change the background to a transparent background by clicking on my background to by clicking on my background to which is this one and then change it to transparent background which is this transparent here so after doing that you would then save the images as PNGs. Save the images as PNGs individually. So I'm going to first of all save the circle image. So I'm going to hide this one. Save this one as a PNG. Format PNG. Format PNG. So change it to Ultra. I save. Then I'm going to do the same for the picture. I'll hide the circle background, then save as a PNG. After that is done, after that is done, the next thing you want to do is you can hide these two pictures and then bring back your background, which is this. Now, those pictures you saved, they are now in your phone. So you're going to click on your phone, import the pictures from your phone into Pixel Lab. So first off, you're going to import the back, the circle shape, which is this. When you import it, you would increase the size to 100. So you go to size, go to size, increase the size to 100. And then you can lock it so it's not be moving and shaking. Then you do, you will now click on the circle shape and add texture you add texture to the circle shape so when you click on add texture you click on your pictures you click on the picture you saved now do not crop do not do anything just click on good so you see how the picture now is inside the shape but we can still notice that the the picture of the lady her head is cut so how do you do this what you're going to do is you're going to still Import, import, that, import that same picture into Pixel Lab. So after adding texture to the circle, we are going to import that picture. After you import the picture, you click on it. You you now enlarge it, increase the size to 100 also. 
after you've done this the next thing you want to do you want to now max this image so you click on you go to your max which is this one which is this one so after that you go to your max you click on your max and you can adjust the max but there's no need because it's already perfect but you can adjust the max if it's not perfect you can adjust how it is and then you click on enable once you click on enable it will cut out this down part of the picture and then the rest of the picture is going to be visible so let's click on enable and then good so we see how it looks like the lady is coming from inside the blue circle so that is how you max your image and this pattern is completely perfect there's no mistakes everything is perfect the other pattern you will make some mistakes because you you, you it's, it's a manual pattern whereas this pattern is a it's an automatic pattern so i believe you've learned how to max images and um going forward you'll be using this in your designs as a professional to give that professional um look whenever you max images in your design thank you for sticking to the end please do not forget to hit the like button to subscribe to my channel and to share this video to other youtubers because we are going to be posting more videos and i want you to be one of the first people that will get our videos whenever we post them so please do well to like subscribe and share and please leave a comment for me anything you do not understand or if you would like me to enhance my videos please leave a comment for me and we'll get right into it thank you very much this is jeffx so do well to put a hex on it